Yo, what's going on YouTube? Just JK and welcome back to my channel for another GTA Online video. And in today's video, I'm going to be fully modifying and customizing and reviewing the new APC tank that just got released with the Gunman and DLC. So as you can see, as always, we've got two different prices. We've got the trade price and we've got the buy it now price. The trade price is, if you can play a mission, you get a little bit cheaper. So if you had up for a little bit of cash, I advise you to do the fucking trade price, man. You might as well do the mission, get it a little bit cheaper because... That's quite a lot different. Quite a lot of difference, man. It's like 700k. So, you know, if you're hard up for cash and you want the APC tank, might as well do the mission. Get it for 2.3 mil. So, without any further ado, guys, let's get this bought. Get it fucking into my MOC and see what sort of modifications we can do to this bitch. So here we go, my bros. We've got a motherfucking tank in the MOC. So as always, we're going to start with 100% body armor. Then we're going to go to the brakes. We're going to get the race brakes for the engine. We're going to get a level four engine upgrade for the horn. I'm going to get. Fuck it, man. Let's get the truck horn. Next, we've got the lights. We've got to get the Xeon headlights. Then we've gone to the livery. We are going to get a livery for this bitch. Definitely. Definitely, definitely. It's not going to be a pixelated or digital, as they call it, on this one. That actually looks really smart. I like that. So I've been going around and around and up and down, looking at all these different liveries, and I've come always come back to this naval geometric, and I think it actually looks... It looks quite nice, man. It looks quite good. So uh, we are going to purchase this. Not really sure what we're going to do for a secondary colour. Uh, but before that, we've got the proxy mines, which we, which we are going to be purchasing. So now we have got the respray. Do we want a, a classic colour on this? It'll be a, a gloss colour. Ooh. Now that looks quite cool and gloss, man. With black as well. I know some people might think it's a little bit boring, but I think it looks the best, man. And uh, we're going to go with carbon black, just because I think that looks fucking pretty sweet with this livery. Next, we've got the transmission. Obviously, we're going to get a race transmission. Then we're going to get the turbo tuning. Then we move on to the weapons. Obviously, we're going to get the sand battery. So then we've got the wheels, wheel type. Can we actually change these? Holy shit. What the fuck? <laughs> no way. No fucking way can you put high-end rims on this. Holy crap. What the hell? That's that's not right. That is not right. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> if anything, you got to put off road rims on it, man. They don't look too bad. But it's the same old fucking shit, you know? I mean, these rims are a lot smaller than the stock rims and they don't really look that great. I'm just going to keep them stock, man, cuz I think they look mean as hell. If you change them to anything other than these, I think uh, you'll be silly. But as always, it's personal preference. This is my personal preference. If this doesn't suit you, go for fucking whatever the hell you like. So then we're going to go on to the tyres. We won't be able to get a tyre design. Nope, because they're uh, not custom wheels. But we can get the bulletproof tyres, which are already fitted. Bonus. And last but not least, we do get a window tin. We're going to go light smoke. Or should we go... Nah, fuck it, man. We're going to go limo on this, bitch. So there you go, my dudes, there is my build on the APC tank. That just looks fucking awesome. Fucking amazing. Let's get it onto the streets and see what else it can do. Right, guys, here we are on the streets of LS. As you can see, I've got a little waypoint down on the map, and that's purely because I believe this vehicle can go in the fucking water. So we're going to try that out. Uh, but whilst we're driving down there, we'll have a quick review on how it does drive. Uh, Speed-wise, it is quite good, man. For, for a tank, for what it is, it actually picks up speed quite nicely. And uh, taking corners with ease. With fucking ease. Let's see if we can go over anything. Just pushes them out of the way. Look at that. Fucking beast. Uh, a downside to this is, even though you've got the proxy mines, that you can drop out the back, which is a fucking uh, nice addition. Uh, the downside to it is, is you need a second person to uh, control the, the, the SAM. Which is, um, you know, I don't want to say dog shit, because obviously they don't want to leave everything up to well solo they can't have every vehicle solo because it would just be OP as fuck uh, so if I just stop here you can see you have to jump out of one cab you hold triangle and you go into the next cab and that's when you get control of the rockets and you only get six and uh, there you go they're the rockets <laughs> nothing special just fucking rockets man but it is a pretty cool tank. Whoa, that was a good one. And um, when you jump out, it resets itself. Yeah, and as you can see, I've uh, used five rockets. Got two left. Uh, so uh, it doesn't look like they're going to replenish after use, after use, which is a shame. But, you know, it's, it's a fast-ass tank. It's a nimble tank. It takes corners quite nicely. It's got fucking rockets on the roof. 
and it can go in the water. That is fucking crazy. This is one crazy, crazy tank. One crazy vehicle. I like it, man. It's pretty cool. Uh, the only downside to it, in my opinion, is that obviously you can't shoot the rockets solo and drive. You can't shoot and drive at the same time. That's the only that's the only downfall for this for this vehicle, in my opinion. Uh, but overall, I like it. It's quick. It's nimble. It uh, shoots rockets, lays proxy mines, goes on the water. What more fucking do you want for a tank? Anyway, guys, that is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, smash a motherfucking like. And if you haven't already, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel for more GTA 5 content. And until next time, guys, I'm out. Adios.